today's how-to video is going to be how to remove the Peg Perigo Superpower Gaucho gearbox. It's this is the first gen. Um, it's something that is, as far as I know, has never ever been replicated other than in this model. It's got these giant gearboxes instead of like the little wimpy Power Wheels brand gearbox. So as I'm taking this apart, I'm realizing that this is very complex and for the everyday guy, this is not an easy task. So some of the tools you're going to need is needle nose pliers, a screwdriver, a Phillips bit on a drill is handy, but you could use a Phillips screwdriver. And the most important one, if you get frustrated, a BMFH. Hopefully we don't need this, but if we get frustrated, we might. All right, so obviously I removed this from the rear of the Super Gaucho to make videoing and uh, the disassembly easier. So first step is going to be to remove the hubcap. It's got three little friction clips. The next step would be to take out the cotter pin and remove the wheel. Now this is without a doubt the most complicated over-engineered power wheel ever created. So it's got these nice high density foam tires. You know, they don't make sound, they give good traction, um, but they don't make these anymore. So if you find one of these, hoard them. So on the back side of the wheel, it's got a wheel coupler. And as you can see, it actually has legitimate disc brakes. Disc brakes, can you believe it? On a ride-on. Uh, it's mechanically operated. There's a pedal on the floor and it pulls like a bicycle cable and it spreads out these two levers right here and applies the brakes. So, you can do it in any order you want, um, but we're going to remove this Phillips screw and the two disc brake screws. Remove the disc brake by wiggling it and pulling it down and out. And that will allow access to yet another coupler. This one is the coupler that goes into the gearbox, that goes into the tire, or into the outer coupler, which goes into the back side of the rim. It's insane why this couldn't be one piece, or even one piece, I don't know. You Italian engineers, you make things so complicated. All right, so now that we've got the wheel off, we can actually slide the axle out. And the next step, because we can't get this gearbox out because there's yet more plastic couplers or adapters or something. So what we need to do, and this thing is very heavy. On the back side here, there's this little plastic nut. You're going to need to remove that. And that will allow the brake levers to come out. So the next step you're going to need to do is flip these out straight. Because that is the secret, that is the key, is getting this straight. So this is where the screwdriver comes into play. Now that you've got this out, you can methodically and evenly pop that out. So now that is out, you can pull the gearbox out. And that, my friends, is the Super Power Gaucho Gearbox.
It is a beast and it is easily able to handle 36 volts, 48 volts even. All right, guys, as usual, give us a thumbs up if you liked the video. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to the next how-to CKC video.